Hello guys, this is Jailbreaker909, and today I'm just going to show you how to make your Stadia faster. Um, what you're going to be doing is upgrading it. And first of all, I want to apologize for the quality. I tried using um, VNC, but that wasn't working for me, so I had to revert to my phone to do this tutorial. But um, here, when we open up Stadia, right off the bat, you notice that the loading screen is not black before it was black and it had city of large I mean it had loading going largely across through here now it just had loading real small there and as you can see there it is very fast it already opened up and we're just gonna go ahead and scroll down let this finish loading a little bit more scroll down now I will have an, a picture inserted here screenshot but um Towards the bottom, you can see that it said Cydia. My well, once you do have it updated, it'll say Cydia 1.0.3366-1. If you have an older version of Cydia, which most likely you do, it'll say Cydia 1.0.322, and then I don't know what the rest is. But it is very simple on how to upgrade it. Um, the user interface is a lot faster. As you can see here, if I click sections, there is sections loaded up. Changes load way faster. So does manage. And so does search. Now to get this upgrade, you're going to want to go add a source in case you don't have it already. And, oh, I'm sorry here. And there will also be a picture inserted right now. But you just go to the top corner and click add. And, and the repo is repo.insanely.com repo.insanely.com so you just go ahead and install that and next you just come to right here to the bottom to search and you're going to go ahead and search pick this up i file it's a i f i l e it's one word now this i file must be from the insanely i repo or the paid repo from big boss because the one from Exilies, which y'all may have or the one from simple iphone does not allow you to access administrator options um which this repo does so but you have to make sure you get it from insane the i if you approve to have it uninstall it install it again next component is safari download manager you just go ahead and down and type in Safari, and as you and it will pop up here, and it'll be the third one most likely. And again, you must make sure it is from Insanely I, otherwise this will not work. Next, what you're gonna wanna do, um, it'll respring once you install that. You're just gonna go into Safari right here, and you're gonna type in the link I have in the description. The link is c l dot l y slash three capital U zero i and you go ahead and click go and this right here will show up. You go ahead and zoom in and right here. Just go ahead and click on download. Right here in the progress bar, you will see that it is commencing to download, and the download is the new Cydia itself. And this Cydia will not delete your packages, so you don't have to worry about this. Simply, all it will do is reinstall it. Now, for me, since I already have it installed, the option will not show up, but for you guys, it'll show up right here. Open an I file, and you just go ahead and open it and wait for me. Now, if this does not show up here, then I will show you how to get to it. Here, you're going to go ahead and open iFile. And make sure you go all the way back to where you have this little slash. And you're going to go ahead and click on bar. Wrong one. Bar. You're going to scroll down to mobile and then documents so it'll be dash var dash mobile dash documents and you'll be here 
and now if in, in Safari it said open up in iFile, it'll, it'll show up to this. And simply all you do right here is click installer. It'll start installing it. Now again, I will have a screenshot of this. Um, you must make sure that it says result code zero. If you have any other thing besides that, it will most likely be because you did not use the right sources that I told you to use, which is repo.insanely.i.com. But you should get result code zero. And once you have that, you just go ahead and respring your device. And you will have the newer Cydia. And it will be working super duper fast. And I just want to thank you guys for watching. Remember to go ahead and subscribe right up there. And thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you until next time. Peace.